Nobody in my family graduated from high school. I never really did homework that much. It was kind of like boring. I mean, a school with 4,000 plus kids, that's pretty, that's a lot. It feels like your number and it wouldn't matter much if you didn't succeed. The dropout rate is huge. It's like the kids are expected to fail. It's about giving young adults the opportunity to, to get ahead in life. I definitely like that I could take college classes. We had a lot of great teachers. You have to be willing to work hard. It's kind of like changed my life. You can never say that it's too late and you should never write off any student. And that's what I think the early college initiative is all about. I am sure I'm going to make it to college. Well, around four years ago, I sort of didn't really care too much. I wanted to fix cars and drive cars, so I started to apply to automotive high school. But my guidance counselor said that I think you should go to this new school. College needs to be demystified. We have a partnership with Brooklyn College for the past three years to help as many of our students experience college and say, wow, you know what? I was able to do that course. I'm taking chemistry, English, Spanish 3, and they're all college classes. Well, I went to another school closer to my home. I didn't really enjoy it because the atmosphere was too big. I just needed attention from my teachers. With the one-on-one -on -one time that you get with the teachers, you have time to talk about what you think you might want to do, what you're better in. You, know, you get to actually know your professors and they know you on a personal level. Like, once you do that, you can't go wrong because not only do you have a teacher, but you also have a friend. Some of them have made such incredible leaps. And it makes me very proud to have them come back from their college courses when they're here and to see them acting and behaving like college students. They're already looking at grad school. And we've developed a really good relationship with Brooklyn College where the faculty here at STAR and faculty members at Brooklyn College work together. It's a totally new environment for us, but we're adapting and changing and learning and growing. It's really challenging, but I mean, if you want to do something bad enough, then, you know, that kind of thing doesn't stand in your way. Well, my mom didn't go to college. She's proud of me because I'm the only one in the family that has actually reached high school and not dropped out. In the end, it really does pay off when, you know what, I'm the first in my family to go to college and it's a pretty good school that I'm going to. Without reach, I'd be in an average high school struggling to figure out what I'm gonna do for college. I applied to Dartmouth and I was accepted. I was also accepted to Cornell University, Johns Hopkins University, Denison University. I'm really glad I came here because I honestly feel that if I didn't come here, I wouldn't have been accepted to UCLA. I truly feel like I'm gonna make some type of difference in someone's life.